Hey, what's up guys? Today I want to bring you an update on the elephant ears that I planted in my garden. I had gotten this shade garden collection packet um, that included the elephant ear bulbs. I got them from Costco. They were big, medium to big size bulbs. Now I planted these way back in the winter time, months ago, I would say around February because it can take quite a while for elephant ears to start to grow indoors. Now some of the bulbs I had gotten had an issue with mold on them and I had done a video where I did a treatment on the bulbs and they came out beautifully, uh, got rid of all the mold and I planted them they did well now mind you i started them indoors i'll also put a link in the description below of the original video where i planted the bulbs and the video about the mold so these are the bulbs this is what they looked like they were called alocasia adora and these grow they're kind of a medium size this is the picture from the packet from um costco so this is how I planted them. As you can see, there was they were starting to sprout a little bit on the side. You can see a little eye there. Now I planted them indoors, like I said, and I covered them over with a plastic top um, so that they can keep some moisture in because um, elephant ears really like to have a lot of humidity. And I also sprinkled some vermiculite on top to try and keep the moisture in now this went on for weeks I thought that they were dead and they weren't gonna grow but to my surprise several weeks so later this is the tallest one look at that beautiful leaf and there's another one coming up and you can see all the roots in here so much so <laughs> it's coming out of the bottom of the pot so they really need to be potted up and I have another two here that also need to be potted up. And I have one that did nothing. That one didn't send out any shoots or any roots. Now, once it got warm enough and I planted these outside, they just took right off. They just started putting out leaf after leaf. I put them in a planter in an area that got, I would say part sun but mostly shade. And I love the way that the leaves look a little bit iridescent when the sun shines on them and the way that they collect the rain. Just beautiful plant. Now they're not the real gigantic ones. These are like a medium sized one and they look great in patio planters. As you can see, when the leaves come out, they come out and then they unfurl. Just beautiful plants, beautiful plants. Now, I would consider this a garden success, and I will definitely plant these elephant ear bulbs again next year. As a matter of fact, I'm going to save these bulbs and plant them when it gets cold and replant them again next year. So that's it, guys. Thanks for watching, and take care.